Guru Maharaj says, we should not be overly, uh, overly confident in our own judgment or assessment of things. It's that ego that is responsible for the situation we're in at present. So, uh, but as you say, overly, we can't be engaged in uh, self-analysis, uh, you know, being candid and honest oneself to the point of being uh, dysfunctional, unable to do anything. Uh, but rather, the, the Vaishnava's way of seeing, uh, like in the song, Yogyata Bichari Kichu Nahi Bhai, saying, if you examine me, you won't find anything of worth or value, but Gurudev, Guru and Vaishnava, by your grace, anything is possible. So the proper attitude of the servitor is to think that I am unfit, unqualified for this service, but nonetheless, the order to do this seva has come to me from Guru and Vaishnav. And with that order comes the, uh, the, the, say the grace, the power, if you will, to the ability to do that seva. Is on the one hand to have a healthy skepticism about oneself, but to have the utmost faith in Guru and Vaishnav Krishna. That's how we balance that. Yasya Deve Pura Bhakti Yata Deve Tata Guru Tashoite Katita Hyarta Prakashante Mahamana. So if we have that faith in Guru and Krishna, Guru and Vaishnava and Krishna, then, and a healthy skepticism about ourselves, then we'll say, by their grace only is it possible to do something. So, as, as Guru Maharaj would say in Bhagavad Gita, karman yevari karaste mapalishu kadachana, you don't have the option to strike, to go on strike. You realize, well, everything's ultimately meant for Krishna. Maybe I'll do nothing then. Or think, oh, I'm so fallen, I can't do anything about that. Uh, I won't even try. I mentioned once that when, in, in 1971, Srila Prabhupada was in Los Angeles, and this one devotee and I, right before his lecture, we had to get different services done in the kitchen and other places. And when they were completed, we could go to Prabhupada's lecture. So we would do this like as fast as humanly possible. And, and so one day, uh, you know, I think the two of us were now gonna start walking to the temple room where Prabhupada is giving a lecture. And I noticed this devotee, he's not going to come. And I said, Prabhu, come on, is, you know, Prabhupada's gonna talk in like, Two minutes, he said, I'm too fallen to go. And I thought, what? And he said, I'm too fallen to, to like be in Prabhupada's presence or to go to his lecture. And, and, and at first this bewildered me, but then I thought like, isn't that the idea? <laughs> Is that we're fallen, we're too fallen, we're the most fallen, etc. Therefore, we present ourselves to Prabhupada, we listen to him, we're bathed in his loving Vaishnava glance, and we, it helps our, us move out of the fallen, transition from being fallen and unqualified to something of value in the eyes of the Vaishnava. So please, come. <laughs> he said, I'm too fallen to go. Saying, the only hope you and I have of you know, rectifying our fallenness is to go through that door and hear from him. This can help us. As fallen as we may be, he can help us. He, his glance, we're told, I mentioned that song was to, someone was taking pictures and Guru Maharaj is like so-called legally blind. 
means he can see a little bit, but not so much. You know. And he sees someone like going, doing, and he said, what are you doing? You know. And he said, I'm taking pictures. And, I, and, and, and you know, the age of the selfie and all that, just understand this was another time. And, and Gromer said, a waste of energy. <laughs> so, but that devotee, Sarvabhavana Prabhu Bengali, is very clever, he said, he said, yeah, if we were taking pictures of like mundane people or something, but you know, I'm taking pictures of you. It's, you know, it has some value for the future. And, and also I wanted him to take these pictures also, but this was in a light mood. And I quoted the line from uh, the Naratam song, what is one? E baru koruna koru Vaishnava Goshai. And it has the line in it about Ganga, Sparaja, how repeated bathing in the Ganga may purify one, but once being graced by the glance of the Vaishnava is immediately purifying. Then equal to you know, hundreds and thousands of baths in the Ganga. But I just meant the Baro Koruna Koro Vaishnava. And Guru Mars, just on the spot, sang the whole song. But within that is the vision, uh, the proper vision of the aspiring servitors. That yes, we're skeptical, suspicious of ourselves and our motives, but we are not suspicious, because Guru Mars says suspicion leads to suspension. We're not suspicious of Guru and Vaishnava. And if they have given us some service direction, then in good faith, we can proceed despite, in spite of ourselves, you could say. <clears throat> we want to forever be under their guidance and gracious glance. Hare Krishna.